who is this person generation z gen z those who are born in the late 90s what is the sociological term you have blaze attitude which attitude blaze attitude what do you mean by blaze attitude this new generation is not excited in anything they are not excited in anything they are not impressed by anything they are not worried by anything they are not excited by anything they are not impressed by anything they are not worried about anything why because they have already experienced all these things so when you for the first time boarded the flight when i boarded the flight you know when today children are boarding the flight when i boarded the flight for the first time there is so much of excitement but kids are boarding the flight no excitement because they have already boarded the flight many times this term blaze attitude was coined by one who propounded a sociology called as ambiguous sociology who is that person who propounded the sociology called as ambiguous sociology ambiguous sociology exactly george simmel who wrote a book metropolis and mental life metropolis and mental life in this book he writes about this attitude called as blaze attitude the urban mindset is characterized by this attitude called as blaze attitude urban mindset why this blaze attitude comes don't care attitude care free attitude not interested in anything that attitude why you know because because you are in a city you are exposed to too much of stimulus overload what do you mean by stimulus overload too much of stimuli you are hit by you are hit by too much of stimuli so when you are hit by too much of stimuli there is a stimulation overload what you do you shut down all this overload stimulus and you keep quiet so when too much of stimulus is there it is causing stimulus overload now what you do you stop listening to the stimulus you stop reacting to the stimulus you just carry on with your work so if some people in the city you can see one person is snatching the chain of a woman one person two persons came in the two wheeler he is snatching the chain of a woman walking on the busy road these thieves they are going very casually nobody took any effort to catch these thieves chain snatchers they all are busy with their work they are not even seeing this happening they are not even bothered to see this they are not bothered to help that women they just go on because overloaded so many chain snatching like this you are not excited you are not at all interested you are not impressed to see this so this point of blaze attitude where you will write in the sociology paper tell me again urban sociology you can write okay urban sociology you can write city is characterized by anonymity city is characterized by anonymity anonymity means what Indifer- indifference whatever happens to the other person i am least bothered i just wanted to ensure flood should not come to my house whether it goes to somebody else house i am not at all bothered blaze attitude 
definitely alienation uh, during the recent cyclone during the recent cyclone people have complained no when you go to the officials when you go to the uh, you know people who are uh, in charge of that they just take it very casually enachi what happened water came to my house water will come to everybody's house only what is your problem that is not your problem that is the problem of all when water will recede it will recede when it wanted to recede insensitivity why because lakhs of people have the same problem the official is pressurized because of this everywhere water came to my house water flooded my house again and again you are getting this information if somebody says water flooded my house it is not bothering you too much you become insensitive when same thing happens again and again you become insensitive 10 times a person failed in the examination 11th time he wrote the examination failed in the examination doesn't bother him doesn't bother him failure will bother only those people who are newly failing if one is becoming habituated to failing failure doesn't bother you see the result earlier no problem next attempt why repeatedly you are experiencing this means same for pleasure as well pleasure as well so this is the attitude of the new generation there is a concept called as generation gap which you can write in the family in family they ask about generation gap do not mention in the syllabus generation gap okay you compare tradition with modern no modern individualism blaise attitude it is totally opposite to imail dorkim dorkim writes about collectivism he was very much unhappy with the nature of modernity that it caused so much of egoism egoism yes or no so egoism egoistic suicide too much of individualism okay so these are some new terms which came in the newspapers which can be written for your sociology answer very few people will write when you write a new term then definitely you will be appreciated because extra effort will be rewarded ordinary becomes extraordinary because of the word extra your ordinary answer becomes extraordinary answer when you add something extra this current affair sociology is that extra 40 marks i wanted the students to improve just because of this exercise you write new terms like this you write some current affairs will you not get one mark extra in one question 38 questions you have 38 marks extra that is going to solve your problem permanently okay